Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the Ori Spark Rugged Outdoor Bluetooth Speaker. First up, let me show you the website real quick so you can see where to get it from. Go to Amazon.com. I'll throw the link up in the description. Alright, so we got the Ori Spark Ultra Portable Wireless Bluetooth Speaker. Now this features a dual stereo built-in mic for hands-free calling. You have NFC and selfie feature. We'll talk about that in a minute. This is an indoor and outdoor speaker because it's splash proof and shock proof. Now it features a 1700 milliamp battery that'll give you 12 hours of playing time and it's compatible with all Bluetooth devices. Now the price for this, $39.99. So you're looking at 40 bucks. Pause this and read it for yourself if you want, but let's just go through some of the features real quick. The newest Bluetooth 4.0 technology for lower power consumption. You got two high powerful 7 watt acoustic drivers, built in 1700 milliamp battery for 12 hours of playing time. Now let's talk about the selfie feature real quick. The unique function of selfie. Press the button to control your camera and take a selfie anywhere with friends or family. Now this also has a built in mp3 player. So you can automatically play the music with a standalone micro SD card or TF card which is not included. Alright so that's a lot of features right there for 40 bucks. Now, summertime is right around the corner. It's time to go outside and hang out. This is what you want to get right here. A little Bluetooth speaker to take out to the barbecues, take with you to the beach, take with you to the fire hydrant on the corner, whatever you do. Okay? Simple presentation, some more specs. Same as the website. Let's pop this open and see what it looks like. Okay, so you get your speaker. Let's see, anything else in here? Okay following everything to the side now you get your usual books and shit y'all know how we do with these save them save them for later and you get two cables so you get your micro USB charging cable one end to, into your computer or your battery charger other end into the speaker that's how you charge it up and you get a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable so if you got a non bluetooth device like an old school iPod CD player Sony Walkman whatever you got Plug it into the headphone jack, one hand into the speaker, and you can still rock your music. Now let's take a look at the actual speaker itself. A little bit of heavy weight to it. Not the lightest speaker, but a nice rugged feel to it. Definitely doesn't feel cheap. Let's check out the button placement. Right, you got a little company brand on the top. There goes your mic. You got a little mic uh, indicator light and a little Bluetooth uh, LED light. Here's your Bluetooth and your call button. You got play, play and pause. You got forward and reverse tracks, and you got a power button. You also have a battery indicator with three LEDs. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Let's see on the other side. Let's see what's over here. Let's open this up. Now, this is splash proof, so you got everything covered up. This is where you're going to have your 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable, and this is your micro USB charging port. There goes your spot right there, so you could drop a little micro SD card in here, which is kind of a hot feature for a Bluetooth speaker. So this way you don't even have to worry about draining your phone battery and pairing it up and all of that. You could just drop some music on the SD card, micro SD card, slap it right in there. And you also have a little reset button, well, which is recess, just in case you get any problems, stick a little pin in there, reset everything back to normal. And you have a lanyard loop. This way you can hang this in the shower, hang this on the side of the grill, whatever you want to do. All right, so let's power this up, see if we got any juice. Okay. Now you got two LEDs out of three for the battery. Okay, so, and you also have your Bluetooth button, which is flashing, so it should automatically be in pairing mode. So now let's just do this in real time. Let's see how long this takes to pair up. Let me grab my, my S6, and we'll see. All right, so let's hit Bluetooth. Turn it on. And we'll see if, uh, if we could connect this real quick. Let's refresh this. Matter of fact, I think I hit the wrong. Okay, there it goes. Okay. Just like that. I would say about 25 seconds. <laughs> That's it. Simple pairing. But now for the most important part, let's do a sound test. All right, y'all see me review a thousand Bluetooth speakers. Some of them sound good. Some of them don't. 40 bucks for this. Let's put it to the test. All right, so let's activate the sound cloud. Let's see what song we got on deck for today. Of course, why not? Let's hit up the Never Link. Now, a lot of people have been asking me what's the name of the song. Let me see if I can zoom in on this real quick. Let the white balance balance out. Purchase Your Tracks by Soul Group, uh, Soul Group Universe. 
All right, so shout out to my nephew and them. They let me use the song, no copyright infringements. I can create a shoe now and get money. Like this if you let me. Oh, this is loud. You can feel the bass rumbling in it. Let me make sure I got maximum value on the phone. Alright, maximum value. Purchase your tracks. Sounds good. So work for the tracks. Alright, let's see. All right, so that's your play and pause. Now, only thing I noticed is there's no volume buttons on this, so you're going to have to use a volume from your device, which, um, let me see. That doesn't kind of, let me see. Let me just try something real quick. Okay, so that's forward and reverse. The forward and reverse work. Let's double tap. Nope. Okay, I don't see any volume buttons on this. Then I have to control it from the device. Mad loud though. Let's let it rock for a second. Yo, this sounds really good, fellas. Purchase your tracks. Purchase the work for the tracks. She know I'm that nigga. She know that's a flash. Has a nice amount of bass to it. It's very loud. Let's see if it moves. That's a Jamaica that's back on the map. You see the bass moving the speaker? If you hear shots and you know it's the night, I'm back in my bag. Like my bag is a rag. Like the top of the Porsche, the Porsche so fast. If I rap, it's like damn. I still skate through the scene. This is not for the book. This is not for the grand. This that sag in the cut. This that eight in the ghost. This that cost in the land. This that Mazi go. But I'm back. Condo OT, but that shit's just a trap. Rafe like a bus, how I sit in the back. It's like a parade when I break up the pack. Don't like a trump, how I sit on the top. I got some bits, I let sit for the drop. I got some bitches and tickets and tickets and luggage. It fits for my budget. I'm a ride for my homie. Okay. I'm a ride for my homie. If I ever have a Let's try, see. Clip slide for my homie. I'm official. I ain't never switch sides on a homie. Six tivies beamer, but I ride like it's stolen. Some case been closed, but I'm high like it's open. The nigga with the bees talking case. Okay, it does have volume up and down. Now, fellas, I hate to say it, but <laughs> that's the only reason I was letting the song rock out so long. I had to take it to the book real quick. I hate to do that. Don't tell any of the ladies that y'all see me doing this. All right, keep that between us, fellas. Don't ever tell anybody y'all see me do that. But you do have volume. Okay, so you got your skip forward and your skip uh, backwards buttons. If you long press on them, that also doubles as volume. Now, I was about to say it doesn't make sense if you could just put a micro SD card in here and play music. You need to have a value control because it's not connected to any device. So we figured that out real quick. You got volume up and down by long pressing on the buttons. Okay, now let me see. Did I did I end up my I ended the SoundCloud? My bad, fellas. Let's try that again now. Let's see if we are uh, still connected. Oh, did I turn the volume all the way down? Let's see. Okay, yeah, okay. This is, let's get maximum value. Okay, you notice the LED when you're hitting the volume button. Okay, so you just hold down the volume. I mean, hold down the button for value. Playing balls. All right, now let's talk about the sound real quick. Y'all just seen me review that Inno Flash speaker the other day. That one will run you about a hundred dollars. This one sounds way better. Now the Inno Flash one, yeah, it looks it looks ten times better. That's more of a classy speaker, and it comes with uh, it comes with the uh, the leather case and all that. That's something a little bit more fancy. This is a, this right here. This is going to be a nice beach speaker when you go to the beach because it's rugged, shockproof, splash proof. This is a nice one for the card game outside in the backyard with the barbecue grill going. But you know when people make it too much noise, you're going to have to increase the sound of your speaker. But if you're having a small barbecue like I have all the time with only about, you know, maybe eight, ten people over, and especially when it starts getting late, 12, 12 1 o'clock in the morning, you don't want to be blasting music too loud. This right here, is this will do the job right here. 40 bucks for this. I'm highly impressed with the sound.
highly impressed. Let's just let it, let's, let, I gotta hear that one more time. Let's get maximum volume. Look how loud this thing is. You can feel the bass rumbling in my hands. This is a win right here. All right, on a scale of one to 10, this is a win for 40 bucks. Now, let's check the uh, hands-free calling feature real quick. Who y'all wanna call? We haven't called a Chinese restaurant in a minute. <laughs> Especially since I've been on my diet. Haven't called a Chinese restaurant in a while, so they, they haven't heard from me. So why not uh, let them know I'm still here? Let me find the number real quick. I even deleted it out of my speed dial so I don't get tempted. All right, so here we go. Bamboo Gardens. Let's find out what time they close. Okay, got maximum Bluetooth volume. Let's talk normal. Yes, hi. What time you guys close today? 11. 11 o'clock. Thank you so much. All right. Okay, so hands-free calling does work. Now, one more thing. One more thing. Let's see. Um, We'll play with that in a minute. Let's, uh, matter of fact, let's check out that selfie feature. That's something I was kind of curious. I've never seen that before on a Bluetooth speaker. So what I'm going to have to do... Sorry, fellas. <coughs> Let me pause the video for a second and breeze through this manual because I don't want to give y'all the wrong the wrong uh, information. So I'll be right back. All right, fellas. Now, I had to breeze through the book real quick. And unfortunately, the selfie feature only works on iOS devices. So this will only work on your iPhone, your iPod, or your iPad. Now, let me show you how it works, though. So what I did was I just paired it up to my iPhone 6. Let's go to camera. Let's find something to take. Matter of fact, let's find something to take a picture of. I got this battery charger right here. Let's go to camera. Okay, so now when you go to camera, to use the selfie feature, all you have to do is tap the button and take a picture. All right, so now that's a hot feature to have on a Bluetooth speaker. All right, that's crazy. So 40 bucks for this. Y'all heard the sound for yourself. On a scale of one to 10, this is a win. All right, this is a major win right here. Now get yourself something like this. Also, now this is gonna be a perfect combination for the barbecues. Okay, now I reviewed this before. This was the ZVE portable battery charger. This portable battery charger, you can charge two devices, so your phone and your speaker. You also have a flashlight and a lighter. A flashlight and a cigarette lighter built in to this rugged battery charger. So now when you go to your barbecues or you go to the beach, go wherever you're going, put both of these in your bag, drop the cables in, and you're good to go. All right, so 40 bucks for this. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think. Like I said, on a scale of 1 to 10, this is a major win. Major win. The sound on this is great. A lot of bass. Mad loud. You can't really ask for more than that for 40 bucks. And all these little uh, bonus features like the micro SD card and the selfie button. If you got an iPhone, crazy. Crazy. All right, so like I said, hit me up. Let me know what y'all think. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the Amazon Warrior on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys a lot. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces.